Good morning. Let's think about thanks and talk about them. And actually write a simple program that will use thanks with Redux. Let's say we have a simple note taking app. You can add new notes, new note, add it, add some other note, and another note. But every time you reload the page, all the notes will be lost. So let's save them on the backend using Redux Thunk. Let's look at the code. Here is the app. We have a new node input, which is an input field and a button. When you click the button, it calls the add node property function with the node text and clears the input, sets the node value to an empty string. The add node prop in our case dispatches an action add node with the node value. This dispatched action gets to our nodes reducer. It is this add node case, and in our add node case, we process it. We take the previous value of the state and update the nodes by creating a new array with the previous contents of the nodes array and the new node value from the action payload. Now let's go back to our app, add another horizontal line and below it let's add two buttons, save and load. And these buttons should trigger thunk actions that will post the data to our backend or get it from it. On save click we want to trigger on save function const on save equals a function where we dispatch save notes and on load we trigger on load event we define the on load function that dispatches load notes now we need to create the, the thunk action creators before we can do this, we need to install Redux Thunk. Yarn add Redux Thunk. After it's done, go to Notes Reducer and create a new Thunk. Const save notes equals a function that returns a function. This part will be postponed. It will be executed when the function will be dispatched. And this inner function accepts the method dispatch and get state. So in a way thanks are just like regular action creators but instead of creating an object that will be used to calculate the new value of your state they create a function in which you can access your state, access your store data and dispatch new actions. So in our case we want to get the notes list const notes equals get state notes and then we need to save them on the backend. So we call fetch HTTP localhost 4000 nodes. And then we need to pass the options method post headers is an object accept application JSON content type application JSON. And body is the JSON stringify nodes. Let's make this function asynchronous so that we can use await. And after we've posted our nodes, let's alert success. Export the save notes thunk. Now let's enable thunks in our project. Let's go to store.js, import thunk from Redux thunk, import apply middleware from Redux and after our notes reducer pass apply middleware thunk. Go back to app.js and import save notes from notes reducer. Now let's write the load notes thunk. Back in notes reducer, let's create another function load notes. Here we don't need to pass the options, we can remove this object. So it will be a get request. We don't need to get the notes from the state. And instead of dispatching success, we will store the result of this call into the nodes constant. And then we will dispatch a new action. And we'll need to create another action for it. Uh, the action will be set nodes. It will allow us to override the existing nodes. We also need to parse the fetched nodes as a JSON. So we call then response response json let's go to actions create
create a new constant set notes equals set notes copy the action creator create a new one set notes and the type is set notes actually let's use the constant set notes and here let's also change it to the constant add node the set notes action creator accepts the list of nodes and the payload will be nodes go back to the app and import the load nodes as well now let's write the set nodes reducer case set nodes equals return state and we set nodes to be action payload let's go to the browser try to create a bunch of nodes add node add node and some other node maybe some number node save it we got success okay now reload the page we have no nodes here load and here we go we got the whole list recovered thank you for watching this video if you want to pick the topics of the next videos then join my discord server and vote there on the video ideas channel have a good day and see you next time